I dumped the use of Google Analytics as an analytic tool for my website a few years ago because we caught Google playing games. And I won't go into all the details, but a blind man, Ray Charles, could see that Google was cheating on the statistics as they were reporting to my site. And I caught them over and over and over. And anybody with a fourth grade math ability could have caught them. It just so happens I used to write stat classes for colleges and universities. This was child's play to catch them. And I'm surprised it's taken this long for someone to successfully sue them, take them into court, win, and get a judgment. Unfortunately, this happened in Europe. Here's the story. Google's been found to be skewing searches to manipulating the internet to benefit themselves with their own ads and against ideologies and philosophies that they disagree with. Google has 90 days, according to a court order out of the EU, to give equal treatment to rival sites. Failure to comply risks fines up to 5% of daily revenue. They're already paying out $2.7 billion, which is really chump change when you look at what they have profited from their illegal behavior. So the, the penalty will barely make a dent in their $90 billion cash hoard. Google faces the prospect of less ad revenue and regulatory backlash targeting other services for maps to restaurant reviews, as well as the threat of even more penalties. It's a start. But it's kind of like stepping on the toe of a mass murder. You're not really changing behavior. You're merely putting a minor impediment into the progress of the event. And of course, this happened in Europe. It did not happen in the United States. And the ruling coming out of the EU is not binding here in the United States. Google continue will continue and no doubt will increase their illegal activity in this country in violation of our antitrust laws and several other fair practice laws they will increase this to make up for the lost revenue in Europe so we can look for more one-sided posts from Google regarding their ad portfolios with regarding to their content searches so American website owners particularly those in the alt-right Hold on, because here comes Google. There's nothing to stop them here. And you want to place odds on whether or not Google is going to be tried in this country? What do you think the odds of that are? And it kind of goes to show you that at least the Europeans have some semblance of justice left in their society. We have justice. It's just us.